Scallops are found in marine waters all around the world, from the polar regions to the tropics. Most species live in relatively shallow waters on a wide range of bottom substrates. Like other bivalves, they have hinged two-part shells made of calcium carbonate. However, scallops cannot hold their shells closed all the way. The shells are held together by the adductor muscle. This muscle is more developed in scallops than in oysters and clams because scallops are active swimmers. They use the adductor muscle to open and close their shell. This motion squirts water out of the shell and propels them quickly through the water. Each scallop has up to 200 eyes along the edge of the shell. The eyes have pupils that dilate and contract in response to light. They use their image-forming, mirror-based eyes to see movement and quickly swim away from predators. The eyes function like telescopes. Scientists still don't know exactly how all the eyes work together. Scallops are filter feeders. They open their shells to filter plankton out of the seawater for food. These tiny organisms get caught in the scallop's mucus. Then, tiny hairs called cilia move the food towards the mouth. This filtering can help to improve water quality by removing suspended materials. It has been found that scallops can ingest tiny plastic particles. This has raised concerns about the potential effects of this on the ocean food chain and human health. Scallop harvesting is one of the most valuable fisheries in the United States, and the U.S. has the largest sea scallop fishery in the world. More than 60 million pounds of meat worth about $570 million was harvested in 2019 alone. Meanwhile, China leads the world in scallop aquaculture. Almost all scallops produced in China are from aquaculture production. In the wild, scallops are often harvested by mechanical drag or by divers. Scallop populations have varied in the last century due to habitat degradation and overfishing. In the United States, careful management has helped some scallop populations come back strong. In some countries, people eat the entire scallop, but U.S. federal law currently limits scallop consumption to the adductor muscle only. Scallops are usually shucked on the boat, and the other parts of the scallop are thrown overboard. Some scallop species have separate males and females, while others are hermaphrodites. Female scallops can produce hundreds of millions of eggs each year. During spawning, scallops release eggs and sperm into the water column, where they combine. After hatching, scallop larvae typically remain in the water column for four to six weeks before settling on the ocean floor. SPAT is the name for the post-larval scallops that have gone through metamorphosis and settled on a substrate. SPAT can be collected for aquaculture. All scallops are thought to start out with a byssus, a bundle of silky filaments that attaches them to some form of substrate, such as eelgrass, when they are very young. Most species lose the byssus as they grow larger. Some scallops are short-lived while others can live over 20 years. Each ring on a scallop shell represents a year of growth. Many kinds of fish and invertebrates eat scallops and their larvae. Many organisms, such as barnacles, can attach to scallop shells. For more marine facts, click the subscribe button.